Hi, I'm Nadia. And I'm Stevie, and we are the co-founders of Active Truth. Nadia and I started Active Truth in 2016. So once we realised there was a need for an activewear brand like Active Truth, we thought, why not us? Active Truth has grown so much over the last four years. We started with a box of 100 tights. Originally, it was just that one box, and then it grew to a bedroom, and then three bedrooms. And we've got a big office here now. We're no longer uh, on Stevie's kitchen bench. So we've seen incredible growth over the last four years. We've faced many challenges with uh, manufacturing. Stevie and I both had no experience in fashion or design. We both came from a communications and I was a lawyer. We uh, met with numerous different suppliers here in Australia or overseas. And eventually, after 12 months of investigating uh, how to manufacture it, we met um, our current manufacturer here in Brisbane and she really has um, held our hand and walked us through the basics one of the best things about manufacturing locally is they are right there at your doorstep. We're really quick to market. We can design a product and have it on the shelves selling within a week. So Nadia was overseas uh, when COVID-19 hit, so we were really uh, aware early on that it could have a huge impact on our business. Uh, once she got home, we were cutting costs left, right and centre, just the uncertainty of not knowing what was going to happen next. Because everything, you know, all of our photos were at the gym and working out and uh, having that language around going out and working out with your friends and all of a sudden you couldn't do that anymore. So all of our marketing and email flows and everything had to change to working from home and self-care and uh, this whole uh, new environment that was new for everybody. Also, it's been this real juggling act of bringing everyone together. But like, I must say, the way that everyone has responded, particularly our local manufacturer, um, our team that we've been working with from day one have really taken the lead, they've been really helpful um, and that's just made our life so much easier. Where to from here? We have a number of plans in place. Uh, we're working really closely with our suppliers. We're going to continue to develop our manufacturing capabilities here in Australia. We're also working with our overseas manufacturers, both in terms of the products that we're producing, the way that we're working with our supply chains, um, and also just being a sustainable business so that we're here for the long run. We know that our customers really love our products. There is a need for our product out there. Um, so it's just being that sort of sustainable, responsible approach. Uh, my advice to anyone that's considering manufacturing here in Brisbane or starting a business or that have gone through difficult times through this um, is know your numbers. I don't love doing spreadsheets and I love our accountants, but uh, you know, those meetings are so crucial, really understanding how much the goods cost to produce, all the operational costs that go into running a business, whether it be your website, your insurances, logistics. It's such a big pie and you really, really do need to understand you know, whether you can be that business that can be sustainable.